Hey guys, so this is the Pixel 8 Pro from all these sides. So can be seen the front display sort of symmetrical. Yeah, the chin might look a lot thicker than that of iPhone, but this 3D model website is slightly wrong and the actual front may look like this. This is the official Pixel 8 Pro frame. So can be seen the top side and chin bezels are smaller than that of the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Wagon. Maybe your gift is being in denial. So overall, the front is something I like a lot. From curve edges of 7 Pro to flat in 8, I was kinda sad initially, but those tiny top side and chin will make up for it. This device is coming in 3 exciting color finishes. The sky finish looks decent, but porcelain and licorice are great too. On the side, we have volume key and power key. Then there's a SIM card tray as well, yes, in the US too. So they are not going eSIM only, and there's Type C port to the bottom. But let's just say you'll be USB Cing soon. You're finally getting USB C charging? What? How did you know? The rear is kinda glossy, contains triple cameras, main which is Samsung GN2, super wide and 5x zoom periscope sensor, this with a flash mic and thermometer body heat scanner. The Pixel 8 series will be powered with Tensor G3 based on Samsung's process so simply won't be powerful than A17 or Qualcomm 8 Gen 3. Yeah, definitely not the best pick for gamers but it is not bad at all. The Pixel 6 and 7 Pro works great, can do decent gaming, has decent battery life too and again software and that camera is something I love a lot. So the Pixel 8 Pro is gonna be an amazing device I am sure. The second gen Pixel Watch is coming too, was spotted at the FCC website and we likely saw it in the Pixel 8 Pro poster. It is slimmer than the Pixel Watch and got new color finish too. This all guys, thanks so much for watching, your thoughts in the comment section below and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.